FedRAMP provides standardized security requirements for the authorization and ongoing cybersecurity of cloud products and services. In partnership with the National Institute of Standards and Technology, FedRAMP developed a conformity assessment program with the goal of producing consistent, independent third-party assessments of security controls implemented by cloud service providers. The roles and responsibilities of a FedRAMP recognized 3PAO are critical. 3PAOs independently assess the effectiveness of security controls associated with the cloud service offerings. 3PAO assessments serve as the basis for which the federal government can make authorization decisions for the use of cloud products and services. This video will provide an overview of the latest updates to the 3PAO Obligations and Performance Standards document. You will learn about the primary updates made to the guidance document and gain a better understanding of the expectations and standards for 3PAOs recognized by FedRAMP. The Obligations and Performance Standards document is intended for FedRAMP recognized 3PAOs and independent assessment organizations, IAOs, that are interested in becoming recognized by FedRAMP. 3PAO leadership and individual assessors should be familiar with this guidance to better understand the program's standards and their roles and responsibilities when conducting FedRAMP assessments. The detailed roles and responsibilities table now includes a pathway for how an IAO becomes a FedRAMP recognized 3PAO. Additionally, the roles and responsibilities for how a 3PAO conducts a readiness assessment review, initial security assessment, annual assessment, and significant change assessment are now detailed. The 3PAO Performance Standards section explains that 3PAOs must meet five specific standards, which include complete authorization packages. 3PAOs must assure that all documentation is thoroughly prepared and is delivered in complete form to the federal government. Documentation quality means clear, complete, concise, and consistent content is developed using FedRAM templates in accordance with FedRAM's general document acceptance. Timeliness and responsiveness means documents are delivered on time according to the schedule agreed to between the government, CSP, and 3PAO. Testing accuracy and completeness means accurate and complete testing is conducted for a CSP's offering in accordance with ISO slash IEC 17020 as revised and FedRAMP security requirements. Assessment integrity maintains that a 3PAO is a neutral, third-party inspection body, and any conclusions are founded entirely by the 3PAO and not influenced by any other party. The government evaluates all 3PAO products and expects superior quality and performance. Quality is expected across the government, regardless of whether a 3PAO is supporting the development of a RAR, an agency, or JAB authorization. In the event that a 3PAO's performance is not meeting the required performance standards, FedRAMP and the JAB have the authority and responsibility to pursue corrective actions. These corrective actions are detailed in the performance management section and include consultation, in remediation, and revocation. If a 3PAO has deficiencies that result in them being placed in consultation, a meeting will be held with 3PAO representatives to discuss specific deficiencies, and the 3PAO will need to develop a corrective action plan, also known as a CAP. If a 3PAO has deficiencies that result in them being placed in remediation, including if the 3PAO fails to complete the internal CAP while in consultation, a meeting will be held with representatives of the 3PAO to discuss their performance deficiencies, and the 3PAO will be required to develop a formal CAP. If a 3PAO has deficiencies or if they fail to complete the formal CAP required in the in-remediation phase, 
they may enter revocation. A letter will be sent to the 3PAO notifying the 3PAO that its FedRAMP recognition status has been revoked, why its FedRAMP recognition was revoked, and that it has been removed from the FedRAMP marketplace. The 3PAO's revocation status will remain in effect for a minimum of six months and revoked organizations are not authorized to conduct FedRAMP assessments. If you have any questions about this document or FedRAMP's 3PAO program, please send your inquiries to info at fedramp.gov. You can also download a copy of this document by navigating to the resources section of FedRAMP.